Hey there living jet set as well. I'm in Margao and it's time for the Viva Carnival 2024. It's like 4 p.m. in the evening. We are all set. We're gonna have a carnival parade here and lots of people coming down this road. I can't wait. I'm super excited. I'm all in the mood. I don't know whether I'm Batman or whatever, but then I'm in the mood for carnival. Join me on this fantastic video that we have coming up ahead. So this is like the end point of the carnival and you have the parade coming from the side which will be culminating here and there's also awards for the best float and uh, I heard that today in this carnival the navy is going to be participating for the first time. The crowd is full of excitement here as you can see people have lined up at the sides there's lots of security also but uh, it's a fun atmosphere and can't wait to get this uh, carnival started. So some quick facts over the Goa Carnival, it's held every year and it's held at different cities across Goa. It's held in Panjim, it's held in Margao. Uh, I'm basically right now walking along the path of the parade. The parade is not yet started. Uh, there's robust security in place and uh, it's good that Goa police is doing a great job here and uh, maintaining the security you have barricades on both sides for people also who are going to be watching the carnival so superb arrangements and just looking forward to it so we are almost at the start of the parade now i can see the distance that the parade is about to start the crowd has really really built up it's a fun atmosphere yeah you have people on both sides of the road so yeah let's go and celebrate viva carnival 2024 <laughs> So every carnival year in Goa has a king and that is King Momo coming on the next float and every year a new king is elected and this year King Momo states that you have to be merry, eat, drink and be merry this carnival. So a quick history about how the carnival and uh, what it is about. So the carnival dates back to Portuguese history which is around 450 years back. And basically the word carnival itself means farewell to meet. So that's why it is actually celebrated a few days before Lent. But over the years the carnival has developed as a festival of great joy, vibrant energy, celebration. And that's why you have like the major carnival also in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. And since Goa was a Portuguese colony prior to gaining its independence and becoming a part of the Indian constitution and India, uh, that's why its roots go back all the way to Portugal. So as the float says, Kao Pio Maja Karoa, and that translates in English to eat, drink and make merry. Or rather make Maggie. The carnival is on full flow here and people are really having a good time, a lot of crowd and everyone is really really having a great time here. 
the most of the floats in the parade have some theme depicting about Goan culture or the history of the country as such. And then every float has a number basically, and then they are voted the best float in different categories. So as you can see some of these floats actually spread a social message and they have a social responsibility too which is very nice to see like the last float that you saw was about vaccinating your dog so and uh, it's very nice it, uh, I think through this events you promote uh, that social awareness about various causes too. Another float that promotes responsible drinking, so don't drink and drive. Well, the next float coming up is uh, highlighting Goa's very famous drink that is Cashew Fenny. We are all saying have some cashew penny, hurrah, and have fun. Well, as you can see, the carnival here is celebrated with great pomp and ceremony and it's still going on and it's almost come to the end we have the sun setting on the horizon we hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did now is the right time to hit that like share and subscribe button until we see you again with many such videos this is meryl from the living jet setter signing off <laughs>